Welcome to Indian Canyons. This place is a sacred to the Native American. It is in Palm Springs, beautiful place. And from here, I want to share with you today a sequence for healthy spines, for uh, treating and opening the spine. This practice is going to be a part of preventative medicine, also healing uh, any imbalances around vertebrae and in the spine. So let's start. So what we're going to do is first we're going to lengthen the spine. We're actually going to put more space in between the vertebrae. After we're going to do that, we're going to explore the four directions that the spine is moving from uh, doing it from a place of structural integrity. Structural integrity means that all the movement starts from the hips and the waist area. These are the heaviest bones in the body. This is where most of the chi is located in the body right here in Dantian the hips and the waist, the vertebras here are really big. So we're always going to start to move from here. After we explore it, I'll share with you a really powerful sequence to uh, realign your spine and to really explore 360 degrees of all the vertebras within your spine. Isn't that interesting? Let's do it. First, move your weight into one foot and then the, let the hip here relax. So see, I'm going to exaggerate it. So we're going to move the weight into one side. Let this hip drop because the weight is on this side. So your hip is going like this and you're lifting this arm up. The arm attached to the rib cage, the rib cage to the spine. Inhale and lengthen. So one more side at a time. Breathe into the side of the spine. Make space between the vertebra with your mind. Go there with your mind, seeing the lumbar vertebra expand, the thoracic expand as you lift one arm at a time and you let the hip relax down, soften down. Really soften the hip and let it flow to the place that it feels comfortable in its socket. Nice. It's a very gentle movement and you can continue it for a longer period of time. The next one we're going to do is we're going to move the hip backwards and we're just going to lean forward. Let the head drop. It's almost like a forward fold, but not full, full on yet. We let the head drop, the upper body drop. Move the hip forward. And look what happens with the upper body. It goes into a, a soft back bend. Let all the bones be very soft and relaxed. Give way to gravity. So when I move the hip backwards, the upper body just falls to the front. When I move the hip forward, the upper body would fall to the back. Nice. It's a very, very gentle movement. Move the hips to one side and let the upper body fall to the other. Relax the head. Let the whole body give way to gravity. Bring the hips back and move it to the other side. As a consequence, the spine is going to fall onto the other side. Like so. Come to the center. Beautiful. You really, when you're softening down, you're really following the movement, the natural movement of your body. You are going into realigning the joint. And let's do the full movement that I wanted to share with you. It starts with the hip making big circles, just big circles. What you notice is that you, when you make big circles with your hips, the upper body 
would fall like we did we saw before into the opposite side so if you push the hips uh, to the right the upper body would fall into the left it's just gonna have to balance itself so now let let that let that movement let that upper body do what it wants to do so move the hip Move the hip forward, going to back bend, move the hip slowly to one side and try to soften the, every segment of the spine as you do that. As you do this movement, only the only thing you do, the only thing you actually do is move the hips in a rotational movement. And what else you do? is softening the upper body and watching the spine from the tailbone to the base of the skull get really soft. Reverse direction. Really be soft. Softness. This movement is uh, taking time to really uh, connect with each segment of the spine separately, noticing how the spine open each segment separately, each vertebra separately. Let the upper body be very soft, very malleable, giving way to gravity 360 degrees, lubricating all the vertebrae, 360 degrees let's go into a forward fold whenever you are there full forward fold this time take a few deep breaths into the lower back don't lock your knees knees are soft or bent if you have lower back issues and slowly raise yourself up thank you so much i hope you enjoyed it if you enjoy this video and you'd like to see more videos like this please click the subscribe button above and the bell button if you'd like to get a notification for any new video i'm gonna upload this is ellie cohen from chiwideli.com thank you